common problems or anecdotes that people who often travel the world may encounter in actual international travel. Theme 1 Getting Lost in Unfamiliar Places A. Excuse me, do you know how to get to the Eiffel Tower from here? B. Sorry, I don't speak English. Parlez-vous français? A. Oh no, I don't speak French either. Do you have a map or a phone I can use? B. Non, désolé. Bon chance. A. Great, now I'm totally lost and nobody can help me. Theme 2 Getting mugged or robbed in dangerous areas. A. Hey, look at that street performer. He's so funny. B. Yeah, he's hilarious. Let's go closer and watch him. A. Okay, but be careful of your wallet and phone. This area is known for pickpockets. B. Don't worry, I have them in my front pocket. They're safe. A. Wait, where's my backpack? I left it right here. B. Oh no, someone must have taken it while we were distracted. A. What? How could this happen? My passport and laptop were in there. Theme 3 Having flight delays, cancellations, or missed connections. A. Excuse me, what's going on with our flight? It's been delayed for three hours already. B. I'm sorry, sir. There's been a snowstorm in our destination and the airport is closed. We're waiting for further updates from the airline. A. But I have a connecting flight in two hours. I can't miss it. It's very important. B. I understand, sir. But there's nothing we can do right now. Please be patient and we'll try our best to accommodate you. A. This is ridiculous. I paid a lot of money for this ticket and I expect better service. Can I get a refund or a compensation? Theme 4 Losing or Forgetting Important Documents or Belongings A. Honey, are you ready to check out? We have to catch our flight in an hour. B. Yes, I'm ready. Let me just grab my suitcase and we can go. A. Okay, great. Do you have your passport and boarding pass? B. Of course, I have them right here in my, oh no. A. What? What's wrong? B. I can't find them. I must have left them in the hotel room. A. What? How could you be so careless? We have to go back and get them. Theme 5 Having fever in the United States while abroad. Receptionist. Do you have an appointment? You. No, I don't. I'm a visitor from Taiwan and I don't have health insurance here. Receptionist. I see. Well, we can take you as a walk-in patient, but you will have to pay out of pocket. The cost of a doctor visit without insurance is about $200-$300, depending on what tests and treatments you need. Do you have a credit card or cash? You. Yes, I have a credit card. Can I use it here? Receptionist. Yes, you can. Please fill out this form with your personal information and medical history, and then wait in the waiting room until the doctor is ready to see you. You. Okay, thank you. You fill out the form and wait for about 30 minutes until the doctor calls your name. Doctor. Hello, I'm Dr. Smith. What brings you here today? You. Hi, Dr. Smith. I have a fever and I don't feel well. I think I might have a cold or a flu. Doctor. Okay. Let me check your temperature, blood pressure, and pulse. The doctor checks your vital signs and writes them down. Your temperature is 38.5 degrees Celsius, which is high. How long have you had the fever? You. I've had it for about two days. I also have a sore throat, a cough, and a headache. Doctor. I see. Do you have any allergies or chronic conditions? You. No, I don't. Doctor. 
Have you been in contact with anyone who has COVID-19 or traveled to a high-risk area recently? You? No, I haven't. I took a rapid test before I came here and it was negative. Doctor. Okay, that's good. Well, it sounds like you have a viral infection, which is common this time of the year. There is no specific treatment for it, but you can take some over-the-counter medicine to relieve your symptoms and drink plenty of fluids and rest. I will write you a prescription for some ibuprofen and some cough syrup. You can get them at any pharmacy. You should also stay home and isolate yourself until your fever goes away, and wear a mask if you have to go out. If your symptoms get worse or you have trouble breathing, you should go to the emergency room or call 911. You. Okay, thank you, doctor. How much do I have to pay for the visit and the prescription? Doctor. The visit is $250, and the prescription is $20. You can pay at the reception desk. Do you have any questions? You. No, I don't. Thank you for your help, doctor. Doctor. You're welcome. I hope you feel better soon. Goodbye. You pay at the reception desk and leave the clinic. You take a taxi to the nearest pharmacy and show your prescription to the pharmacist. Pharmacist. Hello. How can I help you? You. Hello. I have a prescription from Dr. Smith. Can I get these medicines, please? Pharmacist. Sure. Let me see. The pharmacist scans your prescription and gets the medicines from the shelf. Here you go. This is ibuprofen, which is an anti-inflammatory and pain reliever. You can take one tablet every four to six hours as needed, but not more than six tablets in 24 hours. This is cough syrup, which is an expectorant and decongestant. You can take one teaspoon every four hours as needed, but not more than four teaspoons in 24 hours. Do you have any questions? You. No, I don't. Thank you. Pharmacist. You're welcome. That will be $20. Do you have a credit card or cash? You. I have a credit card. Can I use it here? Pharmacist. Yes, you can. Please insert your card and enter your PIN. You pay with your credit card and get a receipt. Here is your receipt and your medicines. Please follow the directions on the label and the doctor's advice. If you have any side effects or problems, you should contact your doctor or come back to the pharmacy. Have a nice day. You. Thank you, you too. Goodbye. Theme 6 Having Cultural Misunderstandings or Language Barriers A. Hello. I'm looking for the museum. Can you tell me where it is? B. Hola, K. Kieris? A. I'm sorry, I don't speak Spanish. Do you speak English? B. No, no hablo inglés. Hablas español? A. No, I don't speak Spanish. Do you speak any other language? B. No, solo español. K. Kieris? A. Never mind, I'll ask someone else. Thank you anyway. Theme 7 Facing Unexpected Weather or Natural Disasters. A. Wow, this is the most beautiful beach I've ever seen. The water is so clear and blue. B. I know, right? This is paradise. Let's go for a swim. A. Okay but don't go too far. The waves are pretty strong today. B. Don't worry, I'm a good swimmer. I'll be fine. A. Okay, have fun. I'll stay here and enjoy the sun. B. Wait, what's that sound? Is that a siren? A. Oh no, it's a tsunami warning. We have to get out of here. 